Kakoni EC2 filament spool replacement. Go to the home page of the Kakoni 3D app, view connected devices, and then select replace filaments. Scan the QR code on the filament spool packaging. After the EC2 emits a beep sound, the light will turn yellow. The filament will automatically retract into the backpack. Counterclockwise rotate the switch to unlock the backpack. Remove the buckle, press the black ring, and pull up the PTFE2. Lift and remove the filament backpack. There are five screws at the back of the filament backpack. Use a Phillips screwdriver to remove them. Flip the filament backpack and open it. Trim off the thicker section at the end of filament spool. Rotate counterclockwise to pull out the filament spool from the backpack. Remove the original filament spool. Unwrap the new filament spool. Untangle its end. And straighten it out. Thread the filament end through the filament outlet of the backpack. Pulling out a small section. Arrange the filament spool properly in the backpack, ensuring that the direction of filament extrusion is towards the left side of the spool. Close the filament backpack and reinstall the five screws. Align the filament backpack with the slot and press it down to secure it. Clockwise rotate the switch to lock the backpack. Insert the filament into the PTFE2. Put the buckle back. Finally, wait for about one minute. The printer will push out the new filament from the extruder. Use tweezers to remove any waste filament that is extruded. Once completed, return to my devices and the filament status will be reset to 100%.